Hey guys, Ike here from Ike'sOutdoors.com. I'm here today to do a review on Ibex Outdoor Clothing. Um, this is a wool clothing line, and I want to talk to you a little bit before I get into each specific shirt that I've got um, about the advantages of wool. If you're a guy like me, been around hunting all my life, um, grew up around mountain men, guys like that, the advantages of wool are, are pretty big, even for warm weather. It's 90 degrees right now, and I'm in a I'm in a shop. And this shirt that I'm wearing is wool, and it feels fine. Absolutely feels really good. So there are some advantages to wool in hot weather, uh, warm weather, and cold weather as well. So one of the biggest things that uh, the advantages to wool is it draws the moisture from your skin and helps it evaporate. That keeps you cool, also keeps you dry. So in weather like this where it's 90 degrees, that's going to help me stay cool. But in weather where it's really cold and I'm in there, the biggest threat to you when you're cold is getting a sweat built up and then sitting down. And as you as your body temperature cools off, that moisture gets in, in into your body and allows hypothermia to set in. So one of the big advantages of wool is it gets that moisture away from your skin, away from your body, helps it evaporate, helps you keep, um, helps you keep dry. The other advantage of it is this is soft and really for hunting, really quiet material. This shirt is extremely soft, extremely lightweight, so very very comfortable too. When I think of wool, I think of itch, and I think of it's going to scratch. And some of the old wool that I used to wear. Um, worked awesome, but man, you didn't want it against your skin. This one, I've got it right up against my skin. This shirt is 87% wool. I think we'll get into the features of it in just a minute, but no itch to it. I've worn um, this base layer, which we'll talk about in a minute, which is 100% wool um, against my skin. And there, it, it is a little bit of an itch, but I'm not going to say it, you don't feel it, but it's definitely not irritable. I'm, I'm perfectly comfortable in this. So it's a nice soft comfortable uh, garment and it's also machine washable so that's really nice as well you don't have to do anything special with this wool to wash it you just put this thing in your washing machine uh, probably want to put it on a certain cycle you know a gentle cycle maybe but it is machine washable so that's really nice too uh, the other thing about it that's really nice for us hunters is wool is antimicrobial this actually will be odor free so that is a really big advantage when it comes to hunting because of the the odor problems that we face, wool is, gives us a big advantage there. So huge advantage as far as I'm concerned when it comes to hunting. Uh, when it comes to working in this kind of stuff, especially for me as a welder, um, this is non-flammable. It won't burn and it won't melt. And I've actually been burned before. I've had shirts, that t-shirts that I wore up and being stupid and not putting protective clothing on or, or got sparks down the back of my protective clothing and had shirts actually just melt to my skin. Um, this wool will not catch on fire and it will not melt. So those are some of the advantages of wool and we're going to get right into covering some of the products that I've got from Ibex and been testing out for the last couple of weeks. Okay, so the first one we're going to talk about of course is this t-shirt that I'm wearing. This is the W2 Sport T and this is a very nice comfortable lightweight t-shirt. Now this is 87% merino wool and I may not be saying that right. I've been criticized for that before. Merino, merino, I say merino wool. It's merino wool, uh, however you say it. 87% merino wool, 13% nylon. It's a real high wool count to it. Really comfortable shirt, really lightweight, just feels awesome. Like I said, it's about 90 degrees in here. I'm in the shop and I've got one, two, three, four, five really hot lights reflecting at me. So it is really hot in here and this shirt feels fantastic. Very comfortable, great look to it too. I love the kind of athletic cut to it, and it's it's awesome, awesome look to it. And I've worn this shirt uh, in the past couple weeks. It's been a great time to be testing clothing because it's been springtime, and now we're rolling into summer. It's now June, and I've had these shirts since the first of uh, May. So I've been able to go through some pretty cool weather, you know, 50s, some rain, some heat, and this shirt has held up really good for me. I really like wearing this shirt. Uh, when I ride my bike. I've been riding my bike and I've been running trying to get in shape for an elk hunt next year and this shirt is great for that. I think it's going to be great for doing any kind of scouting, anything when you're out um, and in the temperatures or out in the in the weather. You know this is a fantastic shirt and it's going to give you all the advantages that wool has and it's going to give you those advantages in the cool looking package which I really like. I think this shirt just looks outstanding and it's so comfortable. This shirt is just absolutely comfortable as can be no itch to it and just lightweight. Now this has a special uh, wool to it. This wool is made in Australia and this shirt actually has a nylon core wrapped with the merino wool. 
So it has that's why it has 87% merino, 13% nylon. But it gives it a real nice soft, quiet feel to it and it just man this shirt just absolutely feels awesome and I love wearing this shirt. So I'm gonna take this shirt off, put base layer on, we'll talk about that base layer now. Okay, so this base layer is the Wooly 150. This is 100% merino wool, and this is an outstanding base layer. I've worn this. We wore. I wore this to Oklahoma when we went down there bow fishing, and it absolutely poured the whole time we were down there. And this base layer felt great. It was in the 40s in the morning, and it got up into the, about the 50s, close to 60s during the day. And this base layer performed awesome. Uh, and here I am again. I'm in a 90 degree shop still feels really good. I've, I've tried this out in all different kinds of weather and it's worked really, really well for me. Again, like I said, it's 100% merino wool. It does have a little bit more itch to it than the than the other shirt, but not bad at all. Definitely not something that's gonna drive you crazy or something that's gonna make you uh, wanna take this shirt off. This has the moisture management advantage that you're gonna find with wool. It also has the odor resistant that, uh, advantage that you're gonna find with wool. This is gonna be good for all season. This is gonna be good for turkey hunting. This is gonna be good for early season, it's going to be good for mid season, it's going to be good for the late season. This is going to be a uh, base layer that you're going to wear next to your skin and it's going to do a good job of keeping the moisture off of your skin and keeping you warm, keeping you dry, keeping you cool and doing a good job of all of those things. And it's one of the reasons I love wool and I love this Ibex stuff is because it is so versatile. Rather than needing, having four or five different, you know, base layers for each, each time of year with this wool, it really does it all, and this Wooly 150 is another outstanding uh, item from, from Ibex, and I, I just absolutely love it. Uh, the color on it, it comes in a couple different colors. You know, it looks really good. It's black, or it's blue and green, but from here on, on camera, to me, it looks black. So it has a good look to it, and I think it's going to work out outstanding for hunting. Uh, again, odor resistant, so you don't have to worry about that being next to your skin. That's one of the things I hate about some base layers, is you get them next to your skin, and they're not odor resistant, they're not antimicrobial like wool. And you get them next to your skin, you get to sweat and you get bacteria growing on your, on your skin. And the next thing you know, you stink, your base layer stinks. And if your base layer stinks, you know, especially in early season from there on out, um, it's just going to emanate out and your odor control, all that spray that you've done before you got out there is, is going to be worthless. So this is a good way to help you control um, your your odor right at the cause of the odor right next to your skin it's going to it's going to be odor resistant so really like this as a base layer okay the last thing we got here is the shack light pullover this is a mid-weight uh pullover it's got, available in a couple of different models but what i got here is the pullover with the the zipper in the front here it's about a 10 inch zipper so it comes down about to your chest i'm not going to put this on because this is this is a mid-weight uh light pullover but it's about like putting on a, a lightweight sweater so uh, really nice uh, for gonna be really nice for cool weather on into a, a layer in cold weather um, this is I like this one because this is US grown wool 100% wool uh, it's about 15.68 ounces so about about a pound uh, it's got a good weight to it I love the weight to it uh, really comfortable again I wore this when we went to Oklahoma on our um, bow fishing trip down there and did a really good job like i said earlier it rained and rained and rained it was cool the whole time we were down there and did an outstanding job i'm actually really really impressed with this one probably the most of all of the three that i've tested because it did an outstanding job and i think it's going to be awesome for hunting uh 100 wool so it gives you all the advantages of the wool uh, really good weight to it for you know like i said in that in our trip down there got down to about 40 degrees and i had this base layer on I had a, a, a shirt over the top of it and I had this on in 40 degree weather absolutely comfortable as can be moisture you know the rain the whole time kept the rain off of me and did a fantastic job of keeping me warm and keeping me dry giving me all the advantages of wool as well it's got a good look to it too it's got a pocket here on the chest it's got the zipper got the high collar on it which I like to get up around your neck uh, it's also got the ibex symbol on the back got the ibex there which looks really cool so uh this is the ibex shack like pullover and uh, probably the most impressive product that uh, as far as to me that i've been able to test from ibex all right so those are the three products that i got to test from ibex and i'm absolutely i love wool and i love the advantages it gives you for hunting you cannot beat wool for hunting and the ibex stuff is top of the line i mean this stuff is outstanding um, outstanding clothing, outstanding products. I love the uh, Shack Light pullover. I think that's going to be an outstanding 
uh, product for early season. Of course, you know, being red, I'll probably put some camo over the top of it, but it's going to be nice for layering. The base layer worked out awesome. This t-shirt has worked out great for uh, everything I put it through. And I put this clothing through tests, like I said, in rain. It Nothing sub-zero temperatures, you know, or anything like that, but 40 degrees was about as cold as I've tested it in, up to it's 90 degrees today. So we picked a really good time to test this out. I've been giving it about a month test, and we've we've covered a lot of different kind of weather in that month. It's springtime in Missouri, so we're seeing a little bit of everything, and we've seen a ton of rain. So really good, comfortable clothing and top-of-the-line quality. And I mean, I've put this stuff through the normal wear and tear taking it bow fishing and stuff like that and bow fishing is not gentle on on anything so it's held up really good to everything i get it or every test i've given it and absolutely love the wool clothing bandages are just outstanding so we'll put a link below to ibex's website and for more product reviews how-to videos be sure to check out our website and that's ikesoutdoors.com appreciate you guys watching